There is a bunch of them. Right, y'all can't even destroy B5 over here. What the fuck y'all think? Right. You can try, but you won't get the goddamn Millennium Tour. Mmm. Mmm. Yo, what's going on, you guys? It's your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer. You're my lovely white gender lead on the ones and twos with her beautiful curls. And this is We Ain't Seen the Reactions, the place where we react to everything we ain't never seen. And today, if you're read by the title, it's time to get into some D. Gray hyphen man reactions. Um. It is getting really good, man. We're getting introduced to some brand new characters that are very interesting. They have some cool concepts and designs going on. Some of them even wear hooker boots to go with their wind powers. You know what I'm saying? Last time we met some guy named Suman or something like that, a Salmon, uh, who also came. Well, he didn't come with this uh, finder, this guy named Gazu or Gazu. He just, just so happened to be accompanying him after we had uh, saw them go out on a little journey. But yeah, we saw that, you know what I'm saying? They went to this village where they were under attack by some wolf Akuma and stuff like that. Um, but unlike the classical story where the big bad wolf goes and huffs and puffs a house down, it was my boy Gazu doing all the damn huffing and puffing. So yeah, man, I really like that character. He seems to be on the same kind of page as my boy uh, Kanda which is cool you know what i'm saying it's always cool to have another elitist badass who think he just all that and in the next one we got a chance to see one of the family of uh, noah's members tiki we got a chance to see more of him what did you think about those episodes i think i liked both of them yeah um, your is up in there boiling yeah i was like i don't know if you want to do this now or what but anyway Hopefully the house don't burn down while we up in her room. Hopefully, y'all. Hopefully the Johnny don't mess up my food. She was the one who was like, let's get this over with. You know what I'm I saying? I only do this because he wants to. I ain't even insist that you even react. I know you didn't, but... So you're going to have them thinking I'm just no, like... No, they ain't for the thing. Slaving you and whipping anyway, you across your bed. So, like I'm saying, Ike Turner. Anime, you better react to the anime. You better. <laughs> <laughs> but no, I, I did like getting to see that dude's like life because he actually seemed like he did not want to lose his human life yeah i guess technically he is a human but his second life right his uh what you call him nipple glasses life yeah the nipple glasses he didn't want to lose that he really you know he liked his friends and stuff like that so yeah man it's like on one hand you want to be rags randy or you want to be top hat terrence which one is it it seems like he's wanting to be like one of those people that kind of toe on the light and the dark side kind of like Riku from Kingdom Hearts you know what I'm saying I'm not gonna be light I'm not gonna be dark I'm gonna be Twilight's in between that thing you know what I'm saying so that's what he wants to be and it was very dark you know even though he's a very giving individual that gives to his friends what I noticed he had gave that damn button or some kind of coin that belonged to that guy that got killed you know he to tortured kid, him yeah yeah, he tortured that old man that ultimately had succumbed to his whatever the fuck happened to him. Right. <laughs> you know, because they never really made it clear what happened. And they really haven't been showing a lot of Tiki's abilities. But anyways, guys, we're going to go ahead and jump into this next episode, which is going to be titled... What are we titled? Charity Bell. So this is going to be episode 37, so let's go ahead and jump into it, man, and get the ball rolling. There are reports of large swarms of Barcelona. <laughs> yeah, I know. But a boy can dream, can't he? Hell no, you can't. We don't have time to waste if we're going to find General Tidal before the Shoot, you was talking about the wind dude having on hooker boots. Everybody got on hooker boots. Seriously. I guess that's what everybody got underneath their robes. Oh shit. Damn, the sky just immediately Seriously. turned black. Oh, like somebody in, uh, summoning the eternal dragon up in this motherfucker? Or is he court jester looking dude? Just the way I like him. Mugen. Unsheathed. That reminds me. Stay is exactly the same as the damn eternal title. Ooh. Ha ha ha. Freddy a up in this motherfucker. How my brother be talking to my mom. <laughs> Come back here. Oh wow, is that the ball he uses? 
Something bad is going to happen to his mom's. And he's going to get that ball off the damn door. It's like I see a drive-by shooting or something happening. Ah, I, <laughs> and that, that little ball is going to drop dramatically. Gonna, uh, get run over by a, a chariot or something. <laughs> I don't think they got, they got cars in this. I don't know. None of them still got chariots. They got chariots here. And you know, motherfucking uh, Akuma do the shooting, so drive-by shootings or fly-by. You all right. You all right. Hmm. Look at this dude. Seriously, bro. He said he ain't even gonna just steal it. He gonna paint over the shit. And voila. This ugly yeah, nigga. That's what I call art. Hey, I fixed your crappy painting for you. Boy, you don't know. So like Backhand this nigga like his mama didn't. Seriously. What? You got a problem? Now you would have the voice of Luffy you too. You do, don't you? What's your name? Hey, come back here. How you gonna steal this man? Uh, catch me? I thought he had stole his easel and shit. I mean, his mm. little canvas. Not nah, what the hell am I? I don't even know. The what little round thing with the colors on it. What? The palette. Man. Go away. Give me one of you just catch it. Hey. Okay. Shaolin soccer, anyone? Mm. Watch it, old man. <laughs> what a little thing you thought you just did, you? You? you know, it sounds to me like Why you're you getting so tired of your life in this town. Because he was born with these annoying birthmarks on his ass. Becoming an exorcist? Me, an exorcist? Aren't exorcists the ones that hunt down all the demons? Right. It would be your job to fight Akuma, and you could start training immediately. You gotta be kidding. What do you really do? Sell kids into slavery or something? <laughs> That's what I would have thought. <laughs> Where's like your you white man? Him, though. Right. Not the white man with the full paper in the window. Exorcists are members of an organization known as the Black Order, and each one has a unique weapon for fighting Akuma. You have one also, which makes you a very special person indeed. You're what's referred to as an accommodator, Deja. Deja? I forgot. As soon as it you know, your presence, your I had a best bud in 10th grade named Deja. <laughs> with it, you travel the world destroying Akuma. Oh, what happened to her? I never would have let you feed me such crappy food. There you are. What are you doing here? Hurry up and run home. Your mother needs you around the shop. Wait! Don't you run away from me! Yeah. <laughs> Is that his dad? Yeah, I guess so. Hey! Did you guys hear the news? A bunch of monsters disappeared at the harbor. Really? Y'all want to run over there? Stupid kids. Hey, you. God damn, them niggas busting hard in the mouth. Right? They usually don't be doing it like that. Hell no, nah, these must be some super Omega Akuma. Step aside, your boys. OG Mac, let's go. What you finna do? Try to stay out of the way. We got a fishing rod. Ooh. Acknowledge the beauty that's in the world. We got some whips. What is that? Right? I'm trying to figure out. Looks like a spirit sword or some shit. Seriously? Damn. Shit, now he's probably like, you know what? I think I might want to be in there. Yeah. That looks pretty, pretty fly right there. Oh, fit in with these squares. Mm -hmm. Holy crap. Cannonballing off the and whatnot. So that is an Akuma. The demons that you hunt and kill. The world is overwhelmed with these creatures, and only we exorcists can stop them. I'll wait for you at the edge of town. <laughs> I know you're coming. I'm not going anywhere with you, old man. Where are you going? Come on, man. Home to terrorize his parents. Seriously. I'm finna have that probably ain't even finna be there when he gets boys. His family finna be dead. Probably. 
It's gonna be his fault for being so stupid. How can an old man like that kill those monsters so easily? Could have been something. I could have been a main Final Fantasy character. I'm stuck on this funky ass island with these birds that don't even flap their wings. Should have listened to OG. The way you be narrating these characters' thoughts is hilarious. That's how I feel though. It's like, man, I'll be mad if I was a generic looking character. Where did you wander off to this time? You know the morning is our busiest time of day. The least you could do is let Why don't you get them other kids to help? Mom, well, being a first sibling, show me hard. What on earth are you talking about? Sorry, I've made up my mind. Nah, no, fuck you. I'm leaving. But you can't just leave. Who'll look after you? Nobody. I'm working. Why don't you look for a job closer to home? Because the job I want to do doesn't exist in this town. Deja? I'm real sorry, Mom. I already made up my mind to go and that's all there is to it. Deja! <gasps> we should let him go. I wonder if the organization lets them break bread with their family members. You never hear about I them. I know, right? You money. never hear anything about that. Who the hell am I doing? They, right, now how they gonna know when somebody knocking on the door. Right. My boy got on them um them Echo Unlimited snap-on pants. <laughs> Old school, I see it. Okay, we doing chalk. What's that? Are you blind or something? It's a doorbell. Something from home? Yeah, guess it is. It kind of reminds me of my naggy mom. A big jerk of a dad, two annoying little brothers, and crybaby sister. In that whole house, this bell is the only thing I really liked. That's a shame. Your family is so annoying. The only thing you like is a damn bell. <laughs> right. Well, I don't need no pictures to be reminded about how annoying y'all motherfuckers is. I can't even be mad at the mm. Ooh. That's a cool power. You can run, but you can't hide. Like Sonic. Will find you. Like a supersonic sound or something. Nice. Yeah. Like reverberates. You gotta be an athletic person to do that one. Yeah, you do. You been working on his legs. Ain't no shooting, no guns. Mm. <laughs> It's almost like it paralyzes them or something. Hell yeah. Ta da! Hey. Are you guys alright? Come on, boy, I'm standing up. Pretty conclusive proof that more Akuma are heading to Barcelona. True. Man, the Order is sending us all into certain death once again. But I guess that's the life of an exorcist. Yet you act like you're having the time of your life. Hey, as long as I don't get bored, I'm a relatively happy man. And ever since I became an exorcist, bored is one thing I've never been. Mm -hmm. In fact, I haven't felt anything but alive. And if we're lucky, the general will too. He's a nasty old man, but if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be the practically perfect person I am today. <laughs> You're so full of yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I do like how his robe is. I wonder what happened to him. Why he got those bandages everywhere? It's probably look cool. You know everybody like to wrap bandages around their arms and legs and head. Narrowed down Tidal's potential hiding places to a single region. It's now our belief that he's in Barcelona. What would General Tidal be doing in Barcelona? Looks like the Akuma are targeting the general. Does anyone know how to contact Mahdi? Ooh. Oh yeah, I remember that. They probably the violated that man. He just station, gave up on life. To drop what they're doing and get to Barcelona. Well, the way they had him hanging up there, that's what it looked like they did. Seriously. Reaver, 
What's the latest report? We've gone through all the innocents we have at the order. Testing has led us nowhere. While we still haven't been able to find anything out of the ordinary, that doesn't mean we don't have the heart of innocence somewhere in our possession. Pavlaska says she can't tell the difference either. So, it's possible that General More Tickle nipple is mm -hmm. the heart. They got the nipple in the area. Right they got now. the triple nipple. Who about to pop out? Boy. Ooh. Five nights at Freddy looking fake. Seriously. Motherfucking Mr. Rogers neighborhood at Prince Tuesday looking at his. Is that old school OG Matt? Nigga still drawing. Man, he gotta be Bob Ross. They inspired this nigga at the Bob. He got that frizzy hair. He do. He be drawing and shit. Come on now. Who y'all think y'all playing? Yeah, he said, no, I didn't like that one. Mm -mm. No, that can't be Bob Ross. Bob Ross will never burn a painting. No, he gonna keep going no matter how much he fucked up. fucked it up. Oh, I'm gonna draw some happy little some shit over this. Seriously. But anyways, guys, that was episode 37, Charity Bell. I see why they call it that now. That's that's a cool yeah. little twist right there, man. This dude, what is his name? I ain't get a chance Tidal. to Tide all. Tide yeah, Tide all. Which sounds like a fucking washing cloth or something. <laughs> get the new all here at Walmart. Right. So it cleans everything, even your ass. Without eating any kind of chemical poisonings or something. But yeah, man, that dude, he looked like he 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 off the chain and he looked like he was having a bunch of shit. Right. I thought he was just gonna be like the jokester character. And also <laughs> shout out to my man Justin Cook who voices this character. It's the same guy that voices Use K you and Meshi. I really love that voice actor. That's one of the Who Tidal or the boy? Tidal. Um the the boy version of Tidal is voiced by um no, Tidal Kareem. is the old man. Oh, Tidal, well, who? I'm talking about the damn boy. I thought you were talking about the old man. Hell no, I ain't talking about him. I'm talking about the. Oh, Deja. I, I, yeah, Deja, yeah. That's what I was talking about. I thought you were talking about the old man. Y'all forgive us. Shit, I'm forgive gonna, him. Lack of communication. Lack right of communica communicating. When you get it's married, key to a good marriage. make sure that the communication is on point. But no, Deja, I meant Deja. He's voiced by Justin Cook, the guy that was Yusuke Yuri Messi. Mm. And baby Deja is voiced by. Um, I don't know what her name, Colleen, whatever. I forgot, but yeah, she's she from Shreveport. Stuff. Well, you might want to check them after we get finished with this little thing. But I'm, I like that little flashback. I'll give that an A. I'm gonna give it another A I actually plus. Actually, like that quite a bit. Yeah, um, because we. It didn't wait too long to give us the flashback. Right. And when we did get the flashback, we understand now, going forward, if he is a certain way, we'll understand why. Exactly. It's almost like they said, let's go ahead and get this shit out of the yeah, way. Yeah, so This we, is a yeah. new character. We're going to give you a little summation. I'm sitting there thinking something bad was going to happen to the family. Thank For God real? it didn't. Because I'm like, how do you get the thing <laughs> off the door? I'm like, something bad must have happened. And maybe that doorbell was all that was left. Yeah, Mama Deja and Daddy Deja like, what going on? We're going to have another right? one anyway. So. Right? Yeah, <laughs> like, at first I was like... Like, look at these two idiots. And I'm like, no wonder they keep having all these kids. Shit, right. You know, he ain't trying to be. It's like, one of these little bastards gonna have to step it up. Anyway. Right? One of them. <laughs> but yeah, um, anyways, guys, we're gonna go ahead and move on to the next one. So let's jump into it. Gonna play with me. I need to put more respect on Lance's name. That nigga go hard. Yeah, right after the last one. Shit. Oh! Let's go! <laughs> the way you just peeked around the corner. I ain't seen this shit. Order. Hot S damn. Sephiroth. And that damn Kuma right there got on church shoes. It did? Yeah, that nigga has some damn Mickey Mouse shoes on the side. <laughs> Fuck. These them super power. God damn. How they just gonna do him like that? <laughs> right, y'all could have just kept it moving, man. You ain't have to do the finder like that. Better hurry up before they drop that shit. Wall well, Maria. Right, that's exactly what that looks like. Let's see a little Titan. 
Oh man, okay, Scar. Oh no, that's my nigga Bob. <laughs> Mustache flapping. Is he slobbing or is he sleepwalking? Maybe he's a shepherd. If he's a shepherd, where are all his sheep? Exactly. We gotta <laughs> think before we say shit, don't we, y'all? No, because <laughs> I, I know sometimes I be saying some shit, I be like, wait a minute, I just said that. Serious. My boy said, I gotta get back to the cribs. Just stole these posters from Regal Cinemas. <laughs> you just stole the posters from Regal Cinemas. <laughs> you just That's stole from Regal Cinemas, man. They ripped them off the wall. You see that? Looks like it's coming from the shore. Looks oh, yeah, it's also Jack right. the Ripper. No. He loved playing those very wild sounding characters. Mm -hmm. Okay, mountain slide. Uh oh, it's Debo. Craig? A black person. Right. Wow. That you? Got that the that beats by JJ is on. That's you. Here I was worried about what could be taking you so long. I should have known you'd be slacking off somewhere. I swear not to rest till he found you. Shut up. <laughs> Somebody needed to tell him. What do you hear? A hundred. Two hundred. There are more than I can count. And I, I wonder if it's supposed to be. High, but there's a lot <gasps> of them. What you rattling over there, man? Rattling you. I think he's near okay. the too. Then damn it, let's go! Trying right. to rattle this little hot thing so I can put it on my darn neck. Cause my neck hurt. Ooh, Ooh. sweet boat. He look mad. Hmm. Very well then. That'll be all for now. Yes, sir. I'd be mad if I had to wear the same clothes as everybody else. Right. Right. Word that the army of Akuma will be closing in on us shortly. But then, at least that way, Akuma can't like pick you out by your clothes. Ooh, his clothes look cooler than the other one. Let me kill him. Trying to hold the enemy back ourselves. You know, this money. More. So some fuck it by your mind! Mmm. Nigga Wong. Best movie line ever. So here's the plan. I want all barrier units to set up along the north gate and await further instruction. Right. All other units return to your post and stand by. Right. Behind them! It probably ain't enough people. It ain't. It don't seem like it's gonna be. Hey, so cool. Where do we stand? There are two more on the right. No, wait. Looks like they're stopping here. And there's three approaching from the left. No, they've stopped moving too. Don't let your guard down. We may Fortify your goddamn mind, soldier. Okay, cause look. Wanda about to pull up here. <laughs> <laughs> they coming from the ground. Yeah, damn. My God, they're coming up from the ground. Oh, God. Ooh. So I was wondering how long I could stay in place with that selfie, but let's go ahead and get to this shit. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> you know, if I was them, I would just let the townspeople get killed. That's gonna sound so bad. I would just let the town people get killed. Yeah. One of y'all called out your loved one's name and caused this shit to happen. One of y'all at least. Mm. So since you didn't have a brain. Why y'all ain't just jump in the water and hide under the bridge or something? No, bro. Damn. Come on, bro. Please. Hey, 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 Mario Strikers over here. Let's go. Yeah, a little too late. Yeah, it's like that little bell up in there makes it me do that shit. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> little tugboat. Go ahead and play me in. Ooh. 
Ooh. <laughs> Fuck. Must be that black dude. Must be. Ooh. Let's give grace. <laughs> yeah. Let's do it. Say your prayers when you eat. Will appear? Yeah, I've heard rumors from some of the other traveling merchants that demons have been popping up all around Barcelona lately. That's why Papa thought it would be better if we all stayed in Villanova for the night where it's safe. It may turn out to be nothing, but it doesn't hurt being a little cautious until we're sure. It's possible that there are demons nearby. Mm. The kid might be like, Where are you going, mister? Right. Are you going somewhere, mister? <laughs> right. <laughs> but he had to be right all the time. I suddenly remembered something very important I have to do. Those demons that Papa was telling us about. It's about them, isn't it? You should stay here with Papa and us. Lucid is right. I didn't want to frighten you by mentioning it, but those demons might be looking for me. <laughs> the last thing I want is to cause trouble for your family, but that's exactly what you'll get if I stay. You understand, don't you? You're pretty old, so you should be careful. If you see a demon, run the other way. That's good advice. Be safe, you two. Yeah, right. I'll be saying an extra special prayer that those demons don't ever find you. Yeah, me too. Ah, your Lord kind Jesus words will get you Christ, nowhere. Today I ask that you please let this man have a safe trip and not get caught by no demons in Jesus' name. Let him man. make it safely home so he can have his Morbius posters to put on his wall. Spots till they love. I found a place about three kilometers east of that big crazy looking tower. Let me think. I'd stand above. And we got a, um, a vaping cigar for a bet. Mm. Oh, that's his Quidditch ball. I'm yeah. like, why is it a random ass bat in his face? Yeah, that's a little trans thing, I guess. You know what they can Let's try talk to up. through. Stay within 10 his, kilometers. His cell phone. Yeah. Transceiver. Okay, now I know what the Quidditch ball is for. I was like, what the hell is they there for? When will you be here? <laughs> okay, then. I see you chose the wrong one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that baby one is so ugly. I wonder if somebody lost their child. And that's what it came out to look like. Like they called out their child's name. It's like, oh my god. It's Nightmare Fuel. You know what? Thank you. Mind blowing. Yeah, right. Y'all thought. That's what happened when you thought, but you didn't really know. Right. He's you gotta again. know. Why does the millennium change the stall? So far off the beaten path. Ah, I almost forgot about this one. <laughs> Ta-da! Hey. Good evening, exorcist. Would you look at that, a human? You wouldn't happen to be an Akuma in disguise. No, not exactly. Something better. What's a human doing Only in Alan were here. like this? He if you don't mind me asking. The fuck is wrong with this nigga? Your name. What should I call you? I'm gonna it's call you. Dacia. Get the fuck out of here. It's Dacia Barry. You're not the one. This doesn't concern you. You know what? No, I don't want to say her name, really but be going. my so friend from wrong. tenth grade that whose name was Dacia. That 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 was her initials. I'll say that DB. Mm -hmm. And her last name is actually quite funny because so yeah, I'm not gonna say. Her but name I can't yet. shake the feeling that you're no ordinary human. 
How about you tell me a little bit about yourself? Have a seat. So much for self-restraint. He must have knew something wrong. You see, I only have so much patience. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad yearbook photo. Hey, right? <laughs> So this nigga got a whole uh, portable in real time face filter. Right. You look upset. Is there something wrong? Come on, we should hurry. Everybody else is put his gloss in this black, but his is gold. They wanted us to be aware yeah, see, of the his is the son of his master's quidditch ball, which is this big they ass soccer ball. Is right. He's <laughs> now headed towards Barcelona. Fast. Barcelona? Remember Devin and the finders we met on the way to Spain? He I said appreciate they were going to Barcelona. Then that's exactly where we're going to. I appreciate to. that. Right. The focus has not all been on Alan lately. I actually really love that. Yeah. Hey, Sean. Let me go straight up the motherfuckers, eh? I better get to your man's shit. He's going to be gone. Shoot. Hopefully his master show up out of nowhere and help him out. It's like you never trust a dude who's dressed up like Flavor Flav. I'm sorry. <laughs> you think he was dressed up like Flavor Flav? Yeah, he was dressed up like Flavor Flav. Only thing he missed was a clock. I thought he was dressed up like Abraham Lincoln. I nigga mean, dressed up like Flavor Flav or T Pain. They look like Abraham Lincoln. Yeah, so both of them wear top hats. Abraham Lincoln had a top hat too. Nobody care about Abraham Lincoln like that though. <laughs> T Pain. <laughs> But uh, y'all. I ain't never seen T Pain had that on. T Pain always wore top hats. What kind of woman of culture are you? I mean, but anyways, guys, um, that's three rings. That's the name of the album. I need to go uh, brush up on my T Pain. Seriously. But anyways, guys, that was episode thirty-eight, titled Freud Title. Um, what does Freud stand for? I'm pretty sure that means something like uh, French or something. I don't know. Freud. Freud, my boy. Yeah, man. Well, I don't know why. It's like we're um, in two different eras. We see um, my man Tidal going about what he needs to do. Like he's trying to reach somebody. I guess he's going to reunite with my boy Deja eventually, you know, master and teacher or teacher and pupil. You know what I'm saying? Right. You know, I'm, I'm hoping that he get over there for Deja get messed over right man tiki it's like you don't know what you he's never about, know what he thinking one minute he calm in his human form then he ain't calm in his gray human joker face form seriously and you just don't never know i'm like he would be the only one that looked like he got some sense but he probably got the least sense out of all of them right it's like he tried to keep it calm and cool but when you really piss him off he just turned into a freak on you like okay he's over there shaking and <laughs> seizing up and shit for real. So it's almost like he up in church. He got the Holy Ghost or something. Y'all. <laughs> Praise Lord. I ain't never seen nobody catch the Holy Spirit like that. And I done been in church a long time. <laughs> you know, I have seen some weird shit up in church. So actually, you might not be too far off. Seriously. Um, but you know, I got new glasses, y'all. I don't know if y'all noticed that or not. But uh, I know it's kind of dark because uh, I got bad eyes. And it's, my eyes was hurting. So anyway, but I got new glasses, though. Yeah, she got new glasses, though. I just want y'all to congratulate me on my new glasses. Yeah, I'm still interested in seeing what Tiki... What, right, I want to know what's he, in his he mind. He did something before, but I want to know what is his backstory. How did he end up that way? How did yeah. all of them end up that way? It's like, I, I really want to know because I feel like the human side of him has a lot of love for the humans. But then again, this could like just be all... Like, maybe he's indebted to the Millennium Earl somehow. Because he was even seeming annoyed when the Millennium Earl told him to do something. He was just like... Oh. Yeah, he's like, I'd rather be back playing cars with right. the boys or Right, so something. I'm going to give... I don't know, y'all. D. Gray Man's starting to look a little bit okay. I mean, I was, at first, <laughs> I'm not going to lie. I hated the show, y'all. Yeah, she hated it, y'all. I did. Um, but actually, as of it. the last several episodes, this has not been bad. Like, this has been very tolerable. Pretty good. Kinda There's a damn wonder. season and I need... Kind of makes you wonder, though, why was this up in here when she could have just grabbed it? I needed time? it. I was looking for it, and I was like, oh, well. I was going to season up the chicken with that. Mm. Anyway, I'll give this an A+. 
Yeah, I'm giving it an A plus too, man. Things are really on the up and up with this show, and I am enjoying it. And then, based on some of the other stuff that I've seen, the animation looks really good. You know, it's only going to go up from there. So, I am very excited. I know somebody had said something about, man, um, I don't know. Like, they ain't got that many English episodes. They're going to watch it in sub. I think they were just saying it because they would rather us watch it in sub. But, shit, I just skimmed through the whole library up on Funimation, and they got all of it in English all the way to hollow. So, I don't know what y'all was talking about. Maybe I'm wrong, but based on the stuff that I saw, they got all the moment of it. we gotta watch this in Japanese is the moment we ain't finna be watching. No, no, I was just finna say we we gonna watch it regardless of what it's or saying. RBG will be watching it by himself. I watch this shit in Portuguese if I have to. <laughs> Vamos lá, you know. Some <laughs> is fucking, that even a Portuguese word? Yeah, it's, that's what Eddie Gordo say like when he um about to fight on Tekken. So oh, okay, Vamos lá. Yeah. But anyways, guys, that's going to do it for us today. We hope you enjoyed this reaction because, as always, we have a blast reacting to them with you and for you. If there's anything that we may have missed, be sure to provide the proper context below without spoiling us because we love that you guys do that without doing what we tell you not to do. But anyways, guys, this is your boy RBG, a.k.a. Random Black Gamer. My girl, Jenna Lee, on the ones and twos. We ain't seen the reactions. We'll catch you guys on the next reaction to The Gray Man. Peace.